How's it guys? I'm Roland from My Life in Africa. I am an overland safari guide, a local tour guide. I guide people from all over the world, safari tours, local tours, national tours, uh, international tours, Botswana, Zimbabwe, Zambia, Namibia. Best part of my job is meeting a bunch of new people. The office experience is amazing. I don't sit behind a desk. Um, and you know what they say, if you're happy in what you do, you never work a day in your life. And that's pretty much where I sit. I don't work, I do this. And this is what I love. I think memorable trips wise, uh, I'm always gonna go back to Botswana. Botswana somehow holds my heart. There is a memorable moment where I was traveling with a buddy of mine from the UAE, his name's Sean. We were leaving uh, Third Bridge in Miremi and there was a tiny little puddle. You know, puddles and me are not friends. Tiny little puddle and I went across the puddle and somebody had obviously been stuck there before and there was a big log. So I basically leaf springs on the log and jumped out obviously, because now I'm not going backwards or forwards. We're getting the recovery kit and I hear his wife shout, lions. And there was, I think it was about four or five female lions just to the left of us. And we just said to her, look, well, there's nothing we can do. You watch the lions, we get the vehicle out and then we can have a nice, nice look at the lions afterwards. But I think that probably stands out. One more that stands out is when I drowned my other vehicle. I think that one was 100% memorable, eight kilometer run back to camp through herds of buffalo, crossing rivers with crocs and hippos. Uh, th there's, there's many, there's many, but those two are definitely probably the, the two standouts. All right, so my relationship with General Tire goes back quite a long way. Um, I've had uh, General Tire in my car before, it was the first initial grabbers I had on my Fortuner. Um, when I bought this vehicle, it actually came out with grabbers on. They were nice and bulky and beefy and I loved the look of the tire, I loved the feel off-road. And then I changed brands to a different tire and I wasn't ultimately happy with that. I didn't really get the, the longevity on the tire that I wanted. It was a little bit less rugged off-road than I'd liked. It did have three side or three ply sidewalls, but it, it, wasn't, it wasn't ultimately what I wanted. Then when I moved down to Cape Town, I was ready to change tires. I was about to do a trip to the central Kalahari. I'd always had the all terrains. I thought, let me just jump on with a, with a mud tire. Let me try these, these general grabber X3s that I've heard so much about. I put them on the car and let me tell you, lightning difference on handling, off-road ability. I've just been happy. I, some of the other tire brands I've used, I've had little knobblies coming off and everything. And I must tell you, I'm, I'm not light on my gear by any means, way, shape or form. I'm pretty rough on all my stuff. Anyone that knows me knows I kind of go balls to the wall with that. For me, the getting the tires and having run through an entire set, um, I was obviously going to make another purchase much later once it was ready to, to get new tires. I was offered a sponsorship by somebody else, not to mention any names. Um, and I actually turned it down because I'd rather spend my own money and buy a set of tires that I have faith in then be sponsored a set of tires and have to talk about it being the best thing. So my relationship with General is more about actually liking the tire and having used it for what it's purpose driven to do and still liking the tire and being, you know, wanting to buy another set. That's, that's pretty much where I sit with General. Donkey is a, an ever work in progress. There is no such thing as a finished Land Cruiser. So he's not finished. Uh, please don't share that with my wife. I've told her it's finished. Donkey is not finished. I will be doing a few more conversions. As he stands at the moment, he is a very fat four ton Land Cruiser. And tire wise, uh, you need something that can cater for that load. These tires cater for the load. Um, I'll give you an example that why I have so much belief in these tires is the last set of tires that I had, the last generals that I had on here, and I'm running the X3s as I said, um, I got 72,000 kilometers out of without a single wheel rotation. These tires have given me the exact load rating. I've run these tires down to really low pressures. Uh, lowest I've been in them is 0.6. I generally pump them for everyday use to around 2.7. And they, they just do whatever I want. Comfort wise, off-road, you can lower it down to 2.2, 1.6, depending on the terrain. And the, the tires just do, just do wonders. And the grip is phenomenal. It, they just they just work. It, in general, they're a general tire that just works.